Yeah, get it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I said I feel invisible. Oh. Hi guys, it's Erbe here and in today's video I will show you guys how to make that effect that you saw in the intro. It is a really easy effect to do. It's only one plugin you will have to have to do this effect in the visual soul. That's the universe plugins as usual. I will leave the link to the plugins in the description, a tutorial and a download link to download them. But Basically, like and subscribe and enough talking, let's get right into the video. So the first step is to sync up the clip with the music. How to do that is uh, press on the music, find the beat you want the kill to happen. Mine is right here, press M on your keyboard and a mark will, with, will pop up. Then you press on your clip and find the shot of impact. It's where the first frame where the rod, red dots appear in your crosshair. Press M on that and it should pop up a marker then you turn on this magnet tool and just slip it in and it should be synced after that you need to do some time mapping how to time map is press press on the clip and press ctrl r then you may add a speed point right on the shot of impact then you go with your pilot on your keyboard 30 frames to the left so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 30, 29 30 press on this pile again Add speed point, then right in the middle, it don't need to be exact, but add a speed point right there. Zoom in a bit so you can see those numbers. Make the first one to 50, the other one to 200. Then you need to play around with the middle speed point. So the last speed point right here is lined up with the beat, so with the marker. So I'll drag like that, and now it's lined up. So as you see. It's really synced and good. So now we can close out of this and we're basically done with this. Now we need to split the clip on the shot of impact. So press on the clip, find the shot of impact. That's where the red dots appear, as I said. Press Ctrl B, that will split it. Then you search up dent in open effects. It's built in in the Dominion Soul plugins. So just drag it on this clip. Go to FX, switch this to type 2, let the size to be in 400, and strength you need to uh, go to the last frame of this clip, keyframe it, and press on it, and press dot 333, and the FX should disappear. Then you go 20 frames to the left, which you can use your keyboard to do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So right here, add a one keyframe more. Go to the keyframe you made before. You can use these. And here you need to make this to dot 250. And you should see this and it should look like this. And it looks really good. What we will do now, we will add some glimmer to when the kill happens. How to do that is delete this. You will have to have the universe plugins for this. So write in uni.glimmer. It should pop up. Yes, right here. Drag it onto here. Press on it. Go to FX. Press on color map and make it aqua light. It will stand you to define, but you should see those colors and this should pop up. What you do now, you keyframe the first frame of when the effect happens. Go 10 frames to the right. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh, I mean 10, so like that. Keyframe it, drag this to up all the way to 100. And it should disappear pretty fast. And now you have your pinch pinch out effect and your sort of glimmer. Hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a like, drop a sub if you did. And comment any tutorial ideas if you have any. Uh, so I can feature in the video and uh, do what you asked for. I'm always happy to help you guys out. So yeah. Bye. See you in the next video.